Okay, this is the start of the production or the assembly line, uh, as you as you can see. So we start with the chassis, and then the axles come comes through it. So we have our line where we try to um, go step by step farther, and then from the sides there come some some systems or or uh, components from yeah. the side to the line. Um, so to be able to prepare some work, so yeah. you don't have to do it in line. So you've got a lot of sub-assemblies down, so off to one side. Exactly. And so we gets, have it on the right side yeah, and as well on the, on the left All side. Oh, there's sub-assemblies right? on that side as well. So, so we the main well. line itself is getting fed exactly. from both sides. So at exactly. the moment, we're talking chassis and axles. And then if you move up here, it starts to kind of look like a forager at this stage. The, the cab is introduced by the looks of things. So that's that's the the most obvious uh, point here. So you see the cabin is is is, is on top. So yeah. it looks like a chopper, or it it starts to look yeah, like yeah. a chopper, right? So th this is the, the the complicated thing when you are talking about a chopper. You have different system you have to integrate. Mm. You have hydraulic. You have electronic. You have um, mechanical things. So, and you can see the hydraulic lines and so on. It's something which goes with every step farther. And yeah, and our work and our challenge is to get those systems integrated. Yeah. Yeah? And it has to work later on. Not only here, exactly, it yeah. has to work for the client, right? And I would imagine as well, you know, when you're working out the, the build order and the build method of these machines, trying to get everything on the line at the right time in the right order and then it's not in the way of the next process as well. That's really demanding. And we always talking about like in the last 25 years, scaling up the, the, the capacity of the, produ of the production. It's not that easy. So no. we had an old um, um, building in the past with not a proper line. And so we did it by hand, step by step. Um, now we have our, since 2013, our new building here, our proper line for the chopper. Yeah. Um, but you, when, you, when you increase the number of choppers, you have to increase the number of workers as well. So, and we need, like you said, we need skilled worker. Yeah, yeah, definitely so, for something like this. <laughs> exactly, because every, perhaps every chopper is different from, from the one you, you built before and you have to have it in mind and... <laughs>